You all look wonderful. Well, good afternoon. It is a real treat to be here with you today, and I hope you have enjoyed this year's Inspire Conference. How nice it is to be together in person. So, my name is Liz Kroll, and I'm here as a member of the Board of Trustees of the Harvard Business School Club of Northeast Ohio. Our alumni organization just celebrated its 100th anniversary, and we enjoy being part of a rich Cleveland history as one of the oldest business school clubs in the world. In addition to promoting business events, we maintain a philanthropic foundation with the purpose of providing financial support for club and community projects. To help recognize the work of outstanding educators, the Harvard Business School Club established the Samuel Elliott Award for Excellence in Economic Education, and that was founded in 1976. Mm. So we've been doing it a while. One of the founders of the club, Mr. Elliott, retired as a senior vice president of Sohio Corporation after 37 years of service. He was keenly interested in business management issues, and he felt strongly that students needed to be prepared to use economic principles to make sound, rational decisions. This award is presented annually to a teacher or a team of teachers in Greater Cleveland for outstanding accomplishments in developing young people, a better understanding of the free enterprise system, and ethical business management and uh, ethics in business can be um, not only important, but very valuable as, as we're learning every day. So there's no better place for us to present this award than here at today's Inspire Conference. And we've really enjoyed partnering with YEI to solicit and review applications for the award. So the award includes a plaque, which the recipient can put in their home office or in their classroom along with a check for $2,500, which they can Woo! use for any purpose, anything at all. So this year, as in prior years, we've had the benefit of a number of outstanding nominations. Thank you very much to everyone who took the time to apply or nominate an outstanding teacher of economic principles in education. This year, the winner is an entrepreneurship and marketing education instructor with over 16 years of industry experience. He teaches career education in the Akron Public Schools, and his skills include employee relations, talent acquisition, college relations, and student engagement strategies. He has taught at North High School in Akron for 14 years, where he prepares high school students for post-secondary studies and the workplace through contextual learning and on-the-job training. His students have competed in the DECA national competition for three consecutive years, and the last, and last year, excuse me, two of his students placed fourth in the state of Ohio for the DECA category, business growth plan, and qualified for the national competition in Atlanta. This year's winner is viewed as a leader within the Akron Public Schools, Northeast Ohio, and the state. He's a trainer and mentor to the entrepreneurship and marketing instructors in Akron Public Schools. He's also president of the DECA District 9 and serves as treasurer and board member for the Ohio Marketing Business Association. But that's not why we picked him. With over 100 hours of professional development from Next Generation Personal Finance, he integrates these principles into his entrepreneurship and marketing courses with a focus on financial literacy. He also is a current Yippie ambassador and a frequent attendee of Inspire conferences. In 2021, this instructor and his students were asked to conduct a pilot entrepreneurship program at North High School sponsored by the Borton D. Morgan Foundation. Hmm. The pilot program was called Entrepreneur which focused on students learning various power school skills and receiving mentorship from local business professionals. During the school year, students met with their individual mentors once a month and completed a business plan. All this in addition to his normal, regular duties as instructor and everything else we've talked about. 
Throughout the program, several of his students started businesses and learned various aspects of entrepreneurship. So for all these and many more reasons, it is our pleasure to present Mr. Eric Matthews with the 2022 Samuel Elliott Award for Excellence in Economic Education. Congratulations, congratulations, uh-huh. Eric, thank you so nice to meet you. Congratulations. You have anything you want to say? Yes. Mm-hmm. I knew you would. <laughs> First of all, can I borrow, I need to borrow $2,500. Is that okay? <laughs> First of all, I would like to thank uh, YEI, the um, Burton D. Morgan Foundation, uh, Akron Public Schools, uh, the Ohio Department of Education, and all of my friends and, and, and all of you out there. For me, uh, it's all about students. It's all about sharing what we have and um, allowing them uh, and being successful in their classes. So I just have a passion for students and making sure that they are ready for college or the workforce. So for the past 14 years, um, that has been what I've been thriving on. And seeing them successful is, is such a great experience. So I wanna thank all of you for all of your support and for what we do, because what we do, we change lives. Mm -hmm. So I want to um, have you give yourselves a hand, even for just being here, and um, I thank everyone for this award. Thank you. Congratulations. There you go. Awesome work, Eric. Um, so I'm here to present uh, the first ever Inspire Founders Award. Uh, the Founder Award was announced last year to honor my predecessor, uh, Deb Hoover, who was at the helm of the Morgan Foundation as CEO and president for 14 years, uh, and Greg Malkin, who was the founder uh, and a retired executive director of the Young Entrepreneurship Institute. This award was dedicated to Deb and Greg to honor their foundational role in building the ecosystem that we get to take a part of uh, in this Inspire Conference. The Founders Award recognizes excellence in youth entrepreneurship education by a K through eighth grade educator in Northeast Ohio. This year's winner was nominated by a supervisor who wished to recognize 24 years of service in the field and passion for bringing entrepreneurship into the classroom. The nominator shared that this individual is constantly researching methods and strategies which can help students be more successful despite barriers that they may face. In addition to encouraging the students to reflect upon their learning, she regularly uses her own teaching experiences as opportunities for growth and skill refinement. This educator has, been, has utilized Young Entrepreneurship's Pitch Challenge, Lemonade Day, and the Biz World program to teach her students creativity, collaboration, perseverance, and problem solving. Mm -hmm. Not only does she enrich the lives of the students and their families, but she demonstrates leadership amongst her colleagues as well. It gives me great pleasure to recognize Stacy Brickman, uh, fourth grade teacher at Wycliffe Elementary School as the first ever Inspire Founders Award winner. Okay, I didn't know about this, so I'm not planning anything to say, but um, thank you everyone. I, um, I believe I know who the supervisor is that recommended me, and she's actually the person who um, introduced me to YEI. And I would really just like to thank everyone at YEI who has really guided me in helping my students with entrepreneurship skills. Um, from Lemonade Day, Pitch Challenge, they've come out, they've helped me to run my lessons, um, given recommendations, and just been great support system. I just really love what I do and being able to add the entrepreneurship skills in the more recent years 
I've really seen growth in my students, and I can't wait to see what they do in the future. And thank you, everyone. Congratulations. Congratulations.